testing testing okay here okay Uh, it's worth five, right? I finish with the finally. Mm -hmm. Uh, finish. Uh, it's worth five. Then uh. I uh, just to check. We got no four and zero, right? Yeah, it's correct four. It's correct four and it's one zero. Bye bye. Okay, I just went to get on Shopee. Let's see whether will it come. Yeah. I thought a bit because it's not a bit soft. Okay, hold on. It is quite loud. Okay, never mind. <laughs> no, I'm uh, adjusting the the in-game uh, voice chat. Hello, hello. Welcome to another stream. Okay, uh, ready, ready. Let's go. Let's go, let's go. Yeah, welcome to another stream. That's not wrong. <laughs> okay. Let's see how much this does. Okay, so uh, continue on. Uh, last time we did this piece over here so we got another two more pieces to do roger let's go onwards onwards down the thing again Hello, hello, hello. You okay? Yep, that was a very long loading screen. Another cut scene, or anything or something? Most probably. Uh, the crows are still there. Okay, let's go. Okay, now this is done, so we left Vault and uh, Rock Furry. Which one go first? Let's go Vault then. Okay, Vault is the uh, other way here.
definitely uh, not creepy at, at all. Skeleton everywhere. You're right. I think this thing, uh, this door was sliding up. Ah, okay, I see it. Yep, so let's just skip that thing. Oh, so that was a uh, loading, okay. Did that do anything? Doesn't look like it. Uh, just see around the area first. Oh, uh, this way, this way. Holy shit. And what happened to you? Basically, I died. <laughs> no, like, uh, I, f I fell into the thing. Okay, and uh, my side here is uh, open now. Okay, I, f I have a note now. Uh, it lies within the vault, I'm sure of it, but I could not find the keys. So we have to find the key, uh, so some sort of key. Great, and I'm the one that is exploring a uh, top side, like the most curious thing ever. Okay, and uh, right now I have a pickaxe. I can knock down stone walls, I think. Okay, hold on. Uh, let me just uh, scout out my area first. Uh, I found some symbols that I can uh, pick up and I think place... Uh, What's this? Like in there or something? Okay. Uh, I have one. I have a few walls here that has a corresponding uh resistance uh, symbol on it. If I remember correctly. Yep. The bucket. The gears. I see, okay. Yeah, okay, so on my side here, I got uh, three uh, walls that I can break down. Uh, the milk bucket thing, the gear thing, and the other one is the hammer uh, icon. However, in the middle of uh, those three walls, I have four like symbols that I can pick up. That I can pick up. Oh, 
okay. Uh, can you try? Wait, uh, give me a moment. It must correspond with the symbols that are at the top or something that I have on my side. Okay, here. I'm faced with a wall. I have eight symbols as well. Uh, I can pick up the symbols at the bottom and uh, put them on the wall. Okay, I'll try. 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 Okay, I'll try.
Do you happen to have a shield with you? I have a shield, a sword, and a book. Okay. Uh, I'll probably need a potion or a chain or a tree pointed crown. Okay, I want to send you the potion, but I cannot send you the potion. It just keeps coming back to me. Um, is there uh, anything that's linked to the potion that you can send over? Uh, I have a book. But uh, I only place it in for the chain on my side. Not nothing else can send over. Uh, do you have a three-headed crown, a three-pointed crown? Three-pointed crown, I have. Uh, currently is placed uh together with a five point uh five-pointed crown. Can you put the three pointed crown in the in the pedestal? I'll see if you can swap over. Huh, I just got it back. I don't know what's going on. Did you manage to figure out anything? We need to figure out what the slap means. Not that I can see. Do you happen to have a uh what what is linked to the potion on your slab? A uh, potion is only linked to book. We try swapping the potion in the book. Okay. Okay, so we have established that we can only swap things according to the slab. Do you have a shield? Uh, yes, I have. Huh, okay. Uh, I don't think there's anything we can swap now. Is there anything on your end? Uh, nothing. I have a sword, a shield, and a three-pointed crown now. Can you put the sword in?
I have, I have a feeling that uh, they are based on the plate, based on the slab here. They can sort uh, in that in that uh row, but they can only fit into the board also using that row. Yeah, that was what I was thinking as well. So, okay. Um, what do you need? Okay, just to share with you on your slab, the the top icon is what icon? Sword, shield, three pointed crown, sword. No, uh, as on the slab, the one with the arrows. Ah, okay. Uh, from bottom up, shield, sword. Clock, three pointed crown. Are you writing it down? Shield, sword, then the clock, then the crown, correct? Positive. Gotcha. Uh, based on the slab here, the only uh, symbols I need is either the three pointed crown. Uh, five, uh, okay, because I have two five pointed crown here, so it's either the three pointed crown or the chain that goes to the either one of them. Then, followed by I have another uh, chain symbol which you probably need the book or a uh, five pointed crown. Okay, so I have the book and the five pointed crown in the chain. I will need to swap them over to you. Can you settle your end first? So at the end of your slab, right, the bottom symbol, uh, what symbol is it and what do you need? We work from there. Right, uh, Roger, uh, as of now, uh, my last uh, symbol is matching with a book and a potion. I have only the potion. Okay, so you need the book from me, right? Okay, uh, why not we keep swapping until we get the required symbols that we need? Correct. I will put the book. Roger, putting in the potion. I need the clock, but you can't swap the clock with me. Do you have a sword with you? No, right? Uh, no more sword. Wait, you have a sword, correct? Correct. You have the... Okay, I will need a sword. A clock. Uh, okay, actually, give me a moment, yeah. Do you have a shield with you? Uh, yes, affirmative. Okay, I'll put the chain. Well, so then I give you the book. on my side the chain can only be sought with a book or the five pointed crown okay so you pass me the book the book can sort with the f hang on book sort with potion or the chain Okay, let's devise a strategy here. Do we work? Is it wise to work from? Wait, so we are swapping until we get it, right? Shit. So what? 
I think uh, we don't put in any of the pieces first. We keep swapping until we get the required one. Sword shield. Okay, so uh, I will end result for me is I need the sword, shield, clock, and the five studded crown. I think on your end it is the same, just that you need the three studded crown. Uh, oof, not. I don't think so. Uh, my side here. Uh, I have. Okay. Uh. My top, my top row, left to right, five pointed crown, five pointed crown, chain, then book. So I will definitely need the potion, followed by. I can't tell because it's all like interchangeable. Okay, I have everything I need except the five studded crown. Which I need a 3 studded crown to change with Or I can take the... You know what, let me just draw the arc Give me a moment No wait, wait, wait. Swap my crown with your 5 uh, thick crown Never mind, uh, you say you uh, want to draw out the arc, the arc, is it? Correct. Roger, you, you just draw out the arc first, then we consolidate what pieces we have. Can you tell me your art again? Okay, from top to bottom, uh, five pointed crown, chain, book, potion. Okay. Okay then, uh, do you want to just uh, write out what we have for the top row? Yep, uh, tell me yours. Roger, uh, left to right, five, uh, five pointed crown, another five pointed crown, the chain followed by the book. Okay, so your book should lead to the potion, right? Either the potion or the chain. Okay, your five-pointed crown, right? You got two of them, so it has to lead to... A three pointed crown and a chain. So we already have established that a three pointed crown and a chain. Your book will then lead to the potion, your chain will then lead to the book. So I was right. You need the um you need all the three the bottom three on your side plus the top one on my side. Roger and uh same as yours it I believe. Positive, same as mine. So, 
what we have here, right, we will need to keep swapping and going down the chain. Yeah, going down the chain, literally. Yep. Roger. Okay, so what are the only things we can swap? We can swap the five studded crown with the three studded crown. Let's do that first. Okay. Then the five studded crown uh we can exchange with the chain. Then the chain we can exchange no. Hang on. No, I have the chip. Three starter crown, five, five starter crown, the sword and the shield. Yeah, correct. So we need to find a way to reverse it somehow. Yeah, let's swap back the chain and the five. Uh, book. Uh, yeah, I'll give you the book. Okay, the thing that is not uh, annoying me in my inventory is the sword and the shield. Yeah, so we, uh, before that I need to give you back the potion, so I'll give you back the potion. And then now I trade in my three starter crowns to your five starter crowns. Correct. Okay, give me the chain, please. I'll give you the book now. Okay, now on my side only got one sword and one shield. I'll give it the clock, give me the sword. Give, then give me the shield. Okay, then uh, what now? I have a clock and a sword. I give you the three crown. Uh, you give me the clock. Now give me the sword. need the chain right? Yep, I need the chain and then the, the three starter crown again. Okay, uh, we will swap the two crowns. Give me you back your crown. And I'll give you the three crown, you give me the clock. 
There we go. Okay, my off is it. That was a fun puzzle. I am telling you, this is very, very creepy. Yeah, I know. It's just green everywhere. Oh, I just saw you. I just saw you. It is creepy. Uh, I have spiders on my roof. I've been seeing those spiders since just now, man. Okay, I'm gonna knock down this uh, wall, this door. I can place the um the pickaxe into the bucket. Pickaxe into a bucket. Uh, can I check uh, what is the bucket filled with? Anything? Just some white sand. Okay. Uh, then uh, I am able to receive it. Okay, I'll pay as you see. Okay, so uh, you, uh, you decide which wall should I break down? I'll probably just go for the left one. You are absolutely right. Okay, so uh, on your end, do you have a row of like graves or something? Uh, yes. For my team, uh, for, let me just break down the, the last wall. The fuck is this? Okay, so basically, uh, I have uh, three different factions with uh, for each of them and I can interact with their grave. Oh wait, so you have like a rows of graves, right? Uh, think of it as a cemetery but with three different uh sections to it and I can open all I can interact with all their graves. Okay, so what I'm seeing here is that the four symbols are actually um four families. I happen to have two of the family's family tree here uh, and a couple of clues um, littered throughout. So, basic... Wait, hold on. Let me just uh, explore this area first. Oh, I found the grave of uh, the YTE. Remember that guy? Yeah. Yep, uh, there is three of them. So, one, apparently there's one more. Two. Three. Okay, so, uh, if you, uh, some of the graves has like uh, animal uh, pictures uh, on, on it. Okay, I understand. I can open a lot of graves here, so let me um, open them up first.
You mean coffin? Uh, yeah, correct, coffin, sorry. Okay, so the objective here is we need to find five keys uh, buried with... So basically, you need to open the five correct uh, coffins or graves on your end. Alright. And all the clues happen to be with me. So, um, yeah. Okay, so let me just um, see what I can do for now. Okay, just to check uh, which uh, family tree are you able to see? I can see the clock, the clockmaker, the gear, the gear people. Uh, but I can see half of their tree only. Uh, I cannot see the other half. Um, moving on, I can see the milk pouring one. Uh, I can see the whole tree for that. Um, moving on, I can see the uh, whole one for the hammer. Uh, the uh, whole one for the hammer as well. Yeah. Okay, so the gear maker one is half, but the other two is whole. Uh, why not we deal with uh, either the milk bucket one or the hammer? Correct, so I will do that now. Um, the hammer chose the bird he loves as his son's name. His XXX mark grave lies in his father's row. Chose the favorite bird as his son's name, is it? Oh, wait, hold on. You can see the names on the coffin or the grave, right? I can see the name and the date. Plus any uh plus any uh, animal. Okay, positive. So this person he chose a bird as his son's name. According to this for the hammer, right? Uh that is um Angel. Either it's either Angel or uh, actually there's only Angel. Angel and Elwin? Possible? I th I think Angel is the answer. Okay, because uh I'm at the ham I'm at the hammer's uh cemetery now. You don't know uh, uh able to repeat uh, the phrase that you said just now? Uh that came for the clues. Okay the the phrase that I read just now, they are on two separate coffins. Um, chose the bird he loves as his son's name. His XXX mark grave lies in his father's row. Okay. Okay, because on my side here, I have a name. Literally, it's just XXX. With a... Something looks like... Uh, eagle or something uh, at the top of it. However, behind him, there is one uh, single uh, lonely uh, grave, which is name is Robin, but the bird there shows I think it's also a Robin. Okay, you know what? Let's find another um, family with uh, with better clues. And then I'll just open up Robin and see, see what. Uh, nothing. Okay, anyway, uh, let's just go back to the... Oh wait, maybe... Maybe the coffins I have don't even correspond to the family. Hang on, it doesn't make too much sense. A moment, huh? Oh, I'll just check uh, which family tree are you near to for that one. I can... Oh, hold on. Oh, wait, hold on. Uh, there is a grave mark XXX, is it? Uh, yes, there's a grave mark uh, XXX uh, for the hammer. For the hammer? Yeah, for the, the Hammer family, uh, there's a grave mark AX. You go to the water drop family, the glass family, they call it. Um, is there an XXX or so? Uh, 
Water drop family. Uh, on my end here, I don't see any water drop though. Eh? Oh no, let me uh, just look around one more time. Oh, uh, I found it. Hold on. Okay, is that XXX there as well? Hold on, one. And. Yep, uh. Affirmative, uh, that's what. Can you open that and see what happens? Slash onto me. My field of vision is now green. Wait, your field of vision is now green, is it? I have a green, uh, like border, uh, hue to it, and I'm hearing voices now. You are hearing voices. Yes, exactly. Okay, so that happened. Uh, on my end, there was a clue that said. The final descendant of the glass blower line. And the OXXX that you open. It okay, open. Then uh, your character just went down into the well. The green spirit thing. Okay, so on my end, right? Uh, what happened is that uh, the clue was the final descendant of the glass blesser line. Um, the, the crib that you open, uh, that belonged to the glass blesser family and it was the last descendant. So... I'm not sure if you're on the right track or if that's not what we're supposed to do. I have feeling that's not what, what we're supposed to do. I think I opened the I opened the, the wrong grave. Okay. So the clues here are actually for what we are not supposed to open. Okay, uh, right now, uh, this tree, I, there's voices coming for left and right. If you wanna just take a look at my, uh, stream, you'll see what I mean. Basically, uh, I, I've heard a lot of people saying, uh, leave us, leave us, go here, go there, oh my god. Just to check, uh, if you're seeing my, my stream, uh, are you able to like hear any of those things? Uh, okay. I can't hear anything uh, on my end, but um, I see what you are um, seeing. It's okay, it's okay. Uh, I think I muted uh, your your stream, that's why. Nope, never mind. I'm also just adjusting it. This is where uh, surround uh, hip words are not that uh, recommended. Yeah, so now I'm just keep hearing uh, them asking me, asking us to leave. Okay. Is there an is there a name on the XXX? No, the name on the XXX it is just XXX. Okay. 
I think I think only that we that's actually what we're supposed to do. We will just go with this idea, okay? Okay, so let me just uh try and figure out the next clue then. The clues are all over the place. Steenhower who sleeps beside her brother. Is there Steenhower here? No, no. Is it is there Steenhower here? Okay, um, alright, so from the Hammer family, right, um, I need you to, uh, name me, okay, uh, hold on, uh, first of all, we are looking for a pair of brother and sister that are beside each other. I have a couple of combinations, see if any one of them exists. Copy? Uh, not really, but uh, carry on. Okay, see if any YDE is beside any Angel. Any YDE that uh, is beside Angel, is it? Positive. I have one uh, opposite of it. One opposite of it. Okay, the end here I have here is from a uh, one two three one to one three zero seven. Opposite it, the YDE is from one two three seven to one two nine six. The steam Howard who sticks beside her brother. Her brother, her brother, her brother, oh my god. Steen, no, this is not the wrong one, this is not the right one. It's uh, this one. Okay, uh, I'm just looking up uh, for any uh, uh, tips for this one. Uh, right here I found is that the tools can be found within the underground chamber that will pinpoint which grave your partner has to pick up. Uh, short readers painted inside. There's a key in each of the major family graves here. That's positive. Uh, I I'm reading the clues. I'm trying to decipher them now. <laughs> Based on what I see is that uh, this green hill is a uh, result of a, of a mistake. The green hill is a result of a mistake, is it? Uh, correct. What I read here is uh, breaking three incorrect graves will cause your patient, uh, your partner to be cursed and lose vision until the eye pass out. Ah, yeah, bye. <laughs> okay. So for this, uh, if I take out one wrong one, another wrong one, uh, there, is, there will be a lot more noise coming towards me. Great. Okay, um, let, let's just look at the clues one more time. A maker of the clock, she admired the peacock. Where is it? 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 A maker of the clock, admired peacock, is it? Correct. Uh, is there any peacock grave? Hold on, looking, looking. Uh, yes, there is. There is one. One single one. One single one with a peacock grave, is it? What's her name? Name is Truden. And which family is she from? 
the gear, the clock one. Okay, Choto, a moment, yeah? Ah, cock. Oh my. Okay, break that grave. I don't have the clock one with me, but I think that's correct. Okay, but one key. Okay, thank you. Uh, next clue. Oh wait, hold on. Oh, once you solve the thing, the clue on my end will fade out. Okay, cool. Nice. Chose the bird he loves as his son's name. That one is for who's? Uh, I don't know. There is no um, indication of family here. Oh wait, first of all, uh, is there another XXX uh, somewhere around? Uh, there's one in the Hammer uh, family. I think I already have uh, destroyed the water droplet uh, XXX grave really though. You have destroyed the XXX droplet um, family, right? So, um... Can you check the Hammer family, right? Uh, the XXX. Uh, Hammer family, there is one XXX. Uh, the the bucket one, there's also a, a, there's also another one. Oh my! Uh, on my end, there's only one XXX, which is the glass lower one. Okay, um Alright, so among the among the uh the water droplet, right? I think I know what mistake I made already. So among the water droplets, um can you find the youngest, the person who died the latest and tell me their name? Person who died the latest. Okay, uh, latest, the what they type the latest is Ray Win, R E Y N W I, died on a uh, thirteen thirty nine. From the glass lower family, is it? Uh, Roger, not wrong. Okay, um, can you search for a pair of, um, okay, search for Rodolph and Bruno, tell me which one is younger. In terms of their birth date, which one is younger? Bruno and what again? Rodolph and Bruno. Uh, Bruno is five years younger. Okay, Bruno is... Bruno, what in... 12.35? Rodolf, uh, 12.30. Okay, Okay, so with 
Bruno, right? Bruno has a couple of children. Let me see. Uh, huh? What was the hint that was uh, pointing towards this family? Uh? I can't find the tombstone really. Give me a moment. Uh. Uh, where is it? The final descendant of the Glass Blair line. So it has to be the youngest, right? Yeah, so probably the one that died the, died the latest. Not necessarily. The one that... So we need to find the youngest child of Bruno. The final descendant, right? Correct. So it doesn't mean that if they die the latest means they're the final descendant. We need to find the youngest child of Bruno. So here I have five children for Bruno. Um tell me which one is the youngest. We have Wolfart. We have Cybran. We have Madoc. We have Witch Fugut. And we have an unknown. Is it? Correct. Okay, the one that died uh, the latest is a real fight. 1332. What about the one that's born the latest? What the latest is the XXX. Which is broken already, right? Roger, not wrong. Then that cannot be the answer. Okay, we move on to... To break uh, the, uh, the Raven. See, it's the, see it's the, late, the last descendant. I don't think it is wise to break that. We go on to another family first. This is uh, something that we are not sure of. Uh, not sure, but I am completely correct. Wait. Uh, it was a uh, win. I see. Okay, pro pro proceed then. Okay, so uh, just to check, uh, we got from the clock maker one, the gear one, and the glass blower one. Is it okay? Okay. Is the hammer and the bucket. Okay. Uh, I don't know where this is. Um. Chose the bird he loved as his son's name. So the only one that I can see here is Robin. So Robin is the son. So Angel must be the father. Or let me check the rest. This is for the hammer. The, ha the hammer I'm aiming at Angel first. But don't break it. Roger. Uh, just to check, uh, hmm. Okay, the Robin that is, uh, I have on my game here is born in, uh, 1256. I don't think the year matters at the moment. Uh, moment. I am very annoyed because everyone is called Yesebran, everyone is called Robin. Oh my god, <laughs> give me a moment, uh, let me think. Yeah, so, uh, the year matters, though. Okay, um, need you to go to uh, the milk bucket. Roger. Here. Robin, Robin. Oh my god. Okay, and milk bucket ready? Okay, is there any grave with a bird on it? Checking, checking. Okay, uh, pop out as a tree that has a picture of a bird on it. One will be a uh, robin. The other one will be falco and a yes bird. 
Okay, what bird does do they have? So here I have four kinds of birds, yeah? So the first one, the one that looked like an eagle is Robin. The second one is a swan. The third one is a peacock. The last one is um, a falcon. So falcon, robin, peacock, or swan. Robin is a small bird. Can you tell me that? The grave's named Robin and Falco has the robin bird on it. Uh, yes, Brad has the eagle bird on it. Yes, sir, Brian has the eagle bird on it. Uh, correct, correct, no wrong. What's the bird? Oh, the eagle is from 1207. The one with the eagle is from 1207. Okay. Are there people... Is there another Yisabran that is older than him? Uh, November. I just went to check. Uh, he's the oldest. Okay. The one with Yisabran has a robin bird on it, right? Uh, an eagle bird on it. A falcon on it. Correct. No wrong. The one named Robin has a Robin on it. Not wrong. The hell, where? Uh, it's either one of these two. I just need to know which one. Robin is from 1256 to 1326. The one with the Falcon on it is from 1207 to 1285. Is there another Robin that is older than that Robin? <laughs> oh my god! Hold on. There is one directly opposite of the ro of the Robin that we had. Uh, yeah, older by about about twenty years. Break your yes, brand. Breaking. Ah, so annoying. Oh my gosh, this is so misleading. Key received. Roger. Uh, we need one more key, I think. Uh, I don't think so. Uh, based on the guy that I saw at that time, uh, just now, it says we buy five keys, I think. How many keys do you have? Uh, three. Uh, we need one more. It's to open a door I have on my end. Okay, the last clue. The Steen Hower who sleeps beside her brother. That will be the hammer, is it? Positive. And his XXX Mark Grave lies in his father's row. So we have these two clues. Okay, let's check if XXX uh, lies in the line of father grave. Is the father or YDE? Negative. Okay, I'll, I'll just tell you all the fathers in the family, okay? There is Engel, there's Thit Boldus, there is Boldwin, and there's Elwin. So these are the four. Elwin, Bowin, uh, Engel, and, and who? One more? Thit Boldus. Oh, Thit Boldus. Okay, uh, Thit Boldus. Bowen and Elvin, they are all uh, aligned uh, together with another four more graves. Only uh, Enhel is uh, separately uh, beside one grave with a falcon on it. 
Okay, uh, I think we can ignore the bird. So we we eliminate in hell. We have uh did boulders. Uh, and hell and uh, the grave beside it, uh, the one we found it, is a great uh, difference of date of birth is just by one year. Okay, um, is the XXX aligned with. Um, it's aligned with everyone except except Angel, right? Uh no. Okay, XXX. Okay. Uh, it's aligned with XXX, okay, give me a moment. Lies in his father's role. It's not the XXX is not in any role, is it? Uh not really, if you can consider the role. Because uh, in between XXX, uh, there is a path leading to a Robin. Um okay. Uh what's in okay, so um the the the, the 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 XXX is in line with a few others, or just as there's a path in between, right? Can you tell me what are the few others? XXX, uh, then uh, after the path is a uh, yes, bright, and then a y y d e. If we got big thing at uh, and this is for the Hammer family, is it? Yeah, I did. I'm in the Hammer family. What? Why? Ah, uh, why would you do this? Oh my. Okay. Um. Correct. Able to check uh with the other families uh XSX and the father the name. I only have one XSX here uh which is from the glass blower family. The water drop one. Uh, the father's name is Bruno. Probably not though, because uh, the glass one, uh, we broke it just now, so no. Correct, so this has, and it's the only clue that's not blurred out on my end. So, it has to be the, um, it has to be for this family. You know what, uh, heck it, let's stick with the other clue. The the stern basically she lies beside her brother's grave. Okay. Uh for which family that one? Uh honestly I don't know. Um but it looks like it's the uh the hammer one. The hammer one Roger. Where did I see it? Oh my god. Is it here? I'm not gonna take you some uh, sneak, uh, sneak peeks into your stream. Uh, I can tell you that you're very lost. Uh, yeah, because the clues are literally all over the place. The Steen Hower who sleeps beside her brother. So we're looking for a sister that's sleeping beside her brother. Correct? Uh, correct. So, okay, so we have a few brother-sister pairs here lah. Uh, actually, we have Engheld and YDE, either one of these three, or one, two, three. Can you name me the graves in the row that they are in? Engheld 
Y-D-E. Can you like go to the graves and then you just tell me like which is the like what are they in the row? Okay, uh that was if I'm uh Y D E uh appears uh three times in this family. No, four times. Positive they're all the girls. Roger. Okay, why DE uh okay the first one I have is in between uh her brothers and Bowen. The second YDE is in between Elvin and Swan Hill. Right beside uh, Swan Hill. Okay, go on. The third one. Okay, uh, the third one uh, shares with the second one. Uh, basically, uh, Swan Hill is in between both of them. Okay, the last one. The last one is beside uh, this uh, Yes Brad. Okay, why DE is not the answer? Uh, move on to Gertrude. I have one here, one only. Who is it beside? Oh, uh, Gertrude over here is the one with the Vulcan. It's beside, uh, Im Sotet and, 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 uh, Angel. Okay, that might be the answer. Keep it in mind. Uh, Swan Hill. Who is Swan Hill beside? You should only have one. Swan Hill beside is the YDEs. The two of them. Okay, the answer is Gertrude. Gertrude is the only one lying beside her brother. Okay, key taken and uh, nothing happened, so I think there's one more. Hang on, you have four keys already, right? Uh, four keys. Uh, just to inform you, when I uh, took a look at the tips for this puzzle, uh, it says five. Let me scour around for the last clue. Uh, she probably should uh, be the XSX guy. Huh. Should be the XSX uh, clue that we had left. Correct, positive. So, uh, on my end, I don't know any other XSX already. This one is up to you. Um, yeah, his XXX mark grave lies in his father's row. This has to be the clockmaker family. Hold on, I'm just uh, walking around uh, seeing the XXX. Okay, I have one in the milk bucket one. Clockmaker, the one with gears, uh, have no graves in that. Okay. Huh. The hammer has one. Okay, so now it's basically the hammer or the milk bucket. Cause they're the, cause they're the one that have the SSX, uh, grave there. Uh, it, it says it's lying beside the same row as the father, is it? Correct. Can you name me all of the graves in the same row as the XXX? Oh, SX. For the, the hammer one, it's like alone in the corner. For the milk bucket one, uh, beside uh, this uh, deep one, uh, Bathead, Falco, and Yes Red. With a hard reach uh, at the corner. Okay. 
Okay. So that's the only one with a father, right? Because Falco is a father. Can you double check if Falco is the father? Just check the year. Uh, SSZ is 1253. Falco is 20 years older. Okay, that should be the one. Okay, uh, I'm breaking up. Uh, anyway, we have uh, one more chance uh, if this goes wrong. Yeah, let's do it. Okay, uh, 50k foul. Okay, send uh the keys to me then. Okay, uh finding the well. Uh, which key do you need? Or oh, all, all of them is it? Yeah, send me all. First key taken. Next key is down. Next key taken. Next key taken. Oh, this is pretty okay, scary. Key, key taken. Okay, uh, last key down. Key taken. Okay, um, I have a map here. Oh my, this is giving me real goosebumps, I tell you. Uh, I have a map here. Um, it's a map of a graveyard uh, with an X on it. I presume that you are in a graveyard, right? Yeah, I'm in a cemetery. Okay, which means you will need to... Oh, thank you for the new follow. Okay, anyway, so we will probably need... I will need to guide you to that spot and you need to dig. Um, okay, so let's um, get this. Let, let me think about how to describe this to you. Okay, that's to note uh, I'm in the... Like the center uh, area with the tree. Okay, um... From the tree, right? Uh, hang on, I, I don't know how to describe this. Um, can you find? Okay, every grave has uh is sectioned into multiple parts, right? Can you find one that is sectioned into two? Okay, tell you what. Uh, th there's an owl um landmark, correct? You were able to see uh, where we came in from, correct? Okay, uh, there, there should be an owl on a door or, or, or something. Yeah, that will be the entrance that we came in from. Okay, uh, can you stand at the entrance and then face the plaza? Uh, facing. Okay, so uh, if you are facing the plaza, right, it is the second grave zone to your left. 
Roger. It will be the hammer. Okay, then enter the first section. Alright, there should be a total of seven graves there. Three in one row, then one with a big with a path in the middle, and then two, then followed by one and some outcropping. Is this correct? Coming into it, uh, three at the side, two at the top left, one at the bottom uh, right, and then uh, one path leading out to one grave, correct? Correct. Is this correct? Uh, yep, correct. Okay, on the path leading to the bot to the last grave on the outside, right? Dig in the middle of the path. Okay, I got a paper of some sort. What does it say? Uh, it says the number 14 with a, a number corresponding to a certain symbol. I'm pulling some form of lever right now. The number 14 corresponding to what? Okay, uh, on my paper, I have one gigantic uh, 14 in the middle, okay. And then below it, I have five numbers, but each of them are corresponding to a certain set of symbols. Okay, I see the symbols on my end. Okay, you know what? Uh, now, right, um, what I think we need... Okay, so on my end right here, um, it's a, um, a set of doors. Each door has a symbol on top. And I have a pickaxe. I'm supposed to break down the correct door. Okay, just to inform you, uh, my symbols are anyway, it just simplified into... Okay, it's basically like a... What the fuck? Oh my. You know how uh, we did uh, like algebra x equals to this number? Uh, yes. Think of x as a symbol. That's all That's all I have here. And I have two different, so I got x and y. Okay, so the first one, uh, one crescent is no, the number one. Three crescent is number three. Five crescent is a uh, five. Uh, Notice so far? Noted. Okay, so I realize that all the shapes are made up of circles and crescents. Alright, okay. So, uh, following up to that, one circle is 10. So, uh, four circles equals 40. Okay, uh, and you have the big number 14, right? Correct. So, it's one circle and... Three crescents, correct? Uh, 14 will be uh, one circle and four crescent. Is there? One circle and four crescents. Okay, I'm here uh, still on the, the page of the tips. Uh, going to this one. Okay, uh, the note shows a big number and other numbers equating to different symbols. Similar to Roman numerals, they have to break down this number to smaller numbers starting for the biggest number applicable. Okay, I got it already. So, the circle is the 10 and the 4 and the crescent is the 1, right? So, your big number is 14. Is this correct? 1, 4? Correct, not wrong. I'm going to break the door. I found it already. Okay, I found something here. Give me a moment. Which I cannot read. Ah, oh, shit. Uh, I can see your stream. Uh, yeah, it's very dark. I can tell. 
Okay, you need to go to another... Oh, hold on. This is part of the map, I think. Okay, uh, head back to the owl um, thingy. There's some more spot you need to dig. Okay, uh, I will need you to go to the first grave on the left side. Roger, water droplet, okay. Head all the way to the end, all the way to the left side, be and beside the left, uh, the leftmost grave. Uh, you dig there. Okay, pick up another number. What number is it? Number is 23, 23. Let me find 23, yeah? Okay. Uh, just to inform you, uh, the snow files that I'm supposed to dig is actually quite obvious. They are a bit whiter than the surrounding. That's good. Two three, correct? Roger, not wrong. Uh, two circle and three crescent. Two circles and three crescents. No, that's not it. Not here. Am I blind? I'm wondering if I'm blind. Oh wait, hold on. Is that? Give me a moment. Huh. What does this thing do? Okay, the situation now is I cannot find the 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 room two circle with three crescents right oh just not wrong there doesn't seem to be such a room here Oh wait, found it, found it. Wait, two, three, right? Yes, a two, three, but I also received a cop. A gear, a gear. Okay, ignore that, it's two, three, right? No wrong, no wrong. I received a gear as well. Let me see what I can do. Is there any way that we can fit the gear anywhere? Uh, I remember the place that uh, we saw each other. There you go. Hi. Here, here, follow me. Uh, where do you go? Here, here. Okay, sorry. Then this way. Let's push this thing.
Good job. And now a winner is a cutscene or more crows? Yay! Oh no, the crows are gone. Yeah, let's return this to the chapel. This way, this way. I can run. I know, how dare you. Cutscene! Uh, he's just there waiting for us. Why have you failed in fighting? Don't desecrate me. These rats, <laughs> they cower in nooks, cracks, crannies, and corners. Fear not my majesty. Fear? <laughs> Okay, let's proceed. Okay, let's go. Third one. The other one is rock very right? Uh yep, the last one. Based on the YouTube video that they have about the heat the legend of Rockbury, it seems to be like an underground like uh town or something. I may or may not be right. Let's let's go then. Uh, this way, this way. I'm here. Oh, you you jump now, is it? Yep. Who knew?
Oh nice, a cable car right. And who is that person there? A dead body. One of us is to go, I think. You want, you go this side? Oh lol. That guy really froze to death, huh? <laughs> yep. Goodbye, frozen one. Who knew a, a cable car ride still existed in ruins? And yep, we're going underground. My suspicions were correct. It was an underground case of the or something. You know the wallpaper that I have, right? Uh huh. Uh, one of it is one of it should be this uh, robbery, I think. I see. You know, as a kid, whenever you take like cable cars, every time they go through the pylons, right, then there'll be this like uh, vibration. I'm actually quite scared of it. Hey, but a lot of at least uh, our cable car technology right now is not like this one. That is true, but if this thing can still stay intact for like, um, I don't know, a thousand years, then it's good, lah. it's good technology. Yeah, and you're talking about the shaking, right? Yeah. Uh, that's not that. Uh, the top is I is like uh almost uh dropping off. It's slipping. Oh, that is very true. It gets even uh more out every time we go through the pylons. I hope we survive then. Yeah, all the pilots was correct though. But hey, we are reaching though, so yeah. Wait, another uh, light show? Wow, okay, that was slow. Let's do this. Yeah, I want to take, uh, when we caught for the cable, when we caught for the cable car, that it came very fast, so which means that uh, that guy froze right, right in the middle of the right. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah, yeah, uh, yeah, this area looks familiar. Yeah, this side is the one that is, uh, in my wallpaper. I see. I have a bag here though. I'm confident it guards what I seek, the giant owl door, but how does it work? I presume we need to open a giant owl door. Yeah, first of all, where is the I where is this owl?
Yep, it's like a I don't know what is it, a like sprayer area or something. It looks very big. Okay. Let's find some way to go up. Somewhere. I mean. Yeah, this way. Are you holding? Pull up for me though, on my end. You need a what? Okay, I have a section of my bridge here uh, lowered down. I ha I need you to raise it up. I think it's linked to your side. I, I pulled a lever. Did anything happen? Uh, yep, my bridge came up. My guess is we'll need to keep the light on somehow. Yep, that is my guess also. I have a boat. A boat? Where are you though? Wait, uh, are we supposed to use the boat to go up? One of us probably. You get on the boat? Okay, what's up there? I have a ah, okay, okay. Uh, you're controlling the. Okay, stop that. Okay, now move it. Okay, stop here. Yeah. 
I can't, I can't move, I can't move it while you're on it. Can you go anywhere? Uh, nope. One more. Anything you can pull on your end? I can hold something here. Yeah, just go ahead. Ah, okay. Uh, I, I see it. Uh, that's a lift. Ah, okay. Continuing on. I can't get to where you are now though. Okay, uh, on my side here, I have a rock on the rope that is literally pulling the light source. Uh, it needs you to be on it also. Yeah, and uh, I need to try and shift this around so that I get where I need to go. Can you... Oh, huh. I cannot get to where that is. I'm stuck. I need to go over. Uh, no, you turn, then this one goes there, I think. Oh, no, no, no. Uh, 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 go back, go back, go, go back, go back. Then go one big round. Not the not the stairs, but you. Ah, uh, okay, okay. First, uh, I believe you 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 have another entrance on the other side though. This side, right? I can't, go, I can't go anywhere from here. Uh, not there. Uh, coming up, but don't touch the, the lever. Are you able to follow the path all the way? Negative, that's a gate. Is there something you can pull on your end? The leaf thing though. Uh, pulling up something. You check whether it's a gate open? Uh, no, it's not. Is there any way you can cross over? Okay, uh, you need to go downstairs. Uh, to me. Yeah, you need to go downstairs. The lever for my gate is, is directly below you. Cross over to the other side. Yeah, so uh we do you go you go back there, you go back there. Crossover? Oh wait, oh, sorry you can't.
There's no way for it to go down, is it? But you can't because that's a gate. No, I can via the stairs. Can you go down? Go downstairs. On the platform you're on, there's no way to go downstairs, is it? Ah, there you go. Okay, shut. Okay, now, uh, your side you have to... Yeah, but then uh, we need one guy to be uh, upstairs. Okay. One stays down here, the other one stays up there. Oh. So I need to go up, right? Yeah, it's somehow I have to uh, go up. Pull the lever again. Moment, ah. Uh. Basically, just stay the lever there, though. So this is the way that it came from.
Okay. No, you just send the evidence. You said you just send the uh, the leaf up. I can work. Okay, pull. I'm back at the start already. I'm back down. Ooh. Oh yeah, down below is it? Yeah, correct. I'm all the way down already. Okay, I'm at the top. Can okay, rotate uh, any of these uh protruding stuff. Protruding stuff? Where are you? Uh, above you. Ah, okay, 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 okay. So um, this is a uh, obviously a light reflection puzzle of some kind. I have. Okay, and I believe in your that room. I is there's some mirrors. Is it? Lots of mirrors and lots of glass panels. Oh, okay, so uh, we are required to make the... Okay, uh, let's check your glass panel. Is there any uh, pattern to it? Yeah, I have. Um, there's very obviously uh, something. Uh, it's likely that we need to combine the things together to make the intended symbol. I have a photo here of an hour. Okay, uh, I think that's what we need to do. Uh, on my glass panes, right, where I have a lot of um, very broken, uh, or rather like black spots. So I think we need to combine them to form the hour. Okay. Uh, why not we just place the one now and see what happens first? Ah, okay, okay. Uh, the wait, hold on. Where this? Where's this thing? No. Uh. Okay. Uh. Above you. Uh. I. I can only see the shadow. Okay. So you can see what's on the wall already, right? Uh. Yep. Ah, okay, okay, okay. Uh, I think I know what to do already. So basically, right, I have all the glass panes here with the shadow thingies. Like, so if I place a shadow, um, uh, let's see. If I place it, if I place, if I place one here, you can see it on the wall. I think. Uh no, but uh, it is uh slanted. Okay, now it should be straight. Like that? And that makes the top part of the hour. Correct. So I have a lot of um planes like that. But uh obviously we can't shoot them all in a straight line. So we will need to uh I have a couple of mirrors here. We can place the mirrors to deflect the light. 
Okay. Uh, hmm. Okay, for starters. Shadow pieces to have. Three, two, three, four, five. I have I have five shadow pieces and six mirrors. Okay. Uh. Uh, okay, let us start from the source light. Uh, to put one, uh, able to see me from middle. Uh, Flint. Where you are? Ah, okay, for you. Place one. Okay, tell you what, uh, I'll try putting a mirror instead. No, the, the, the thing is that uh, the rotating thing is on, at the top is a bit uh, fiddly. Okay. Okay, there you go. So, uh, okay, so we will need to place a glass piece in here first. Okay, then uh, we will need to place a mirror to deflect the light somewhere. You need to take the lead for this puzzle. I can't see from the bottom. Hold on, hold on. I'm in... Still trying to figure out. Okay, so basically, uh, when I when there's a corner uh mirror, there must be another corner mirror next to it. Correct. Another mirror here. Okay, uh, glass. W one more glass, right? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. No, uh, change uh, this uh, glass to mirror. Okay, then glass. Then mirror. How many mirror pieces do you have left? One. So total of how many mirrors and six mirrors total. Six mirrors total. Okay, uh uh we we reset, uh take out everything. Except for the first one, uh. first first one is definitely correct. The first uh, shadow piece is correct. Anyway, uh, start from the start. Yeah, the first one is shadow. Uh, 
Total five is it? Positive. Next one is definitely a mirror. Okay, uh, put mirror Nick. Okay, then uh, glass. I'm thinking the one here, if you can see where I am now, is definitely a mirror. Uh, this one? Here. Because you need to end your light ray here, ma. Yeah, correct. Uh, that one you can just put as mirror. In the area. So if this is the mirror, it has to shoot from this angle here. Here, so here must be a glass. One, two. Those are unused. Okay, uh, just to note, uh, on my top here, I have. Okay, so uh, basically, all my this uh turning uh dials, some of them I can turn fully, some of them I only turn uh, half halfway. I see. Okay. I think we are missing something. I feel that. This wait, give me a moment. Okay, because uh, if you have limited, uh, oh no, okay, uh, there's a gla there's a mirror piece uh, at the corner here. Correct, that one is default. I cannot take. Yeah, no. Uh, so uh, though I think we should be using that. Which means this is rightfully a mirror. And this is rightfully a mirror. Which means this is a glass. All in between. So uh, you need to turn this, uh, this one here. To face this one. No, when I turn, uh, it cuts off. Can turn one more? Oh, okay. I see, okay. I have four mir I have four glass left, one mirror. Uh, bro, what if we turn this one? This one here? Face this way instead. Then a glass piece here. I have no more mirrors already. Oh wait.
To jest deglasja. Ok, something is wrong. I feel that we should zigzag. So, from here, it should come up here, here, then this way. I think. We need the empty space in the middle to put the glass. Ok, hold on. Uh, how many pieces? Uh, do you, uh, are you, uh, do you uh, put it all or got remaining? I have two remaining glass pieces. Okay, uh, never mind. Uh, we, uh, let's just shine it to the wall and see what I get first. So, uh, make the mirror. I got no more mirror. Uh, just take one on the end here. Uh, this one. The, the one I made. You mean this one? Then I'll give you this one. Change this to mirror. I got no more mirror. Isn't this one uh able to take out? Uh, by the way, uh, the frozen uh, guy's uh, head is uh, is uh, right up here also, though. Ah, I see. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Give me a moment, uh. Uh, I'm gonna try experimenting on my own. I will take out the mirrors, okay? Okay. Okay. Uh, if we come down to this, uh, you might go take a pen of it and paper. Uh, sure. Okay, one moment. Here, here, here. One, two, three. Four, five, six, Seven. Okay. So it reflect to here. Here, reflect upwards. One here. One here. Huh. Did I miss something? Here, we'll put the mirror here. Wait, 
Oh, it stops there. I'm on here also. Yeah, no, really it's not used. This one's not used. Yeah. Yeah. I think I solved it. Okay, I need to just turn just turn the things to fit my line. So we start from here, this one. Turn it to face me. Turn this one. Turn this one. Okay, I need to know uh, So now all the 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 hour is there just missed a line is it? Uh the feet are in the wrong position. The feet are in the wrong position. So probably we need to sort around some of the glass pieces. Okay, that's to uh, inform you uh Okay, on the hour here on the right side of the hour facing the hour is something that's like I don't know like a s square with like two circles at the bottom right now it's on the left okay I think this is just the trial and error on on my end. Okay, I I can't see the shape at all. Yeah, no. Uh, that's why I says uh should be on my end the trial error.
right now I'm just uh, turning the glass pin uh, one by one. Understand. Should be the last pin that I need to rotate. Uh, bro, don't block the What really serious? Oh my god! I will have to rotate that until they are perfectly matching the photo. Yeah, I sort of figured. They're all in the correct places already, just this is up to you already. Yeah, uh, I know. The only thing I'm missing is his left wing. Do you want to change the wing? The wing segment? The first one? Mm, probably don't have to. First of all, all I need to do is the uh, then rotate to be the correct uh, direction. Yep. Oh, hello. Hello, hello. <laughs> Thank you for the raid. And Thank you, thank you. This is my first ever uh, experiencing a read for the first ever time. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you. Okay. Am I? Am, am I what? Experiencing a read for the first time? Yes. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Now we're currently waiting for Redstone to do the puzzle on his end. I've done what I could. I'm just staring at this screen. How do I zoom in? How do we look for one glass pane that has like a slope or something uh, going up? Uh, at the first pane. You need to be more specific. What kind of slope? Okay, you see the first pane uh, at the, the top left. Of the shadow that is starting to lose like an eyebrow. Positive. Thank you, Open Hive. You have a. Uh, it's just like one slit or shadow above the big body of shadow. 
positive. I, I, I do see an eyebrow. Um, what do you need me to look for? Yeah, uh, cause right now I'm trying to rotate them. Uh, hold on. Let me see whether, cause I this game. Am... Hmm. No, I think is that either. Yeah, we're feeling a uh, one of the paints is a uh, face wrongly or something. All right, positive. This game is basically an escape room game where you and a friend try to solve puzzles and progress through the story. That's basically, that's basically uh, it. So, uh, since yeah. uh, it's now about 12, uh, let me just uh, read up what direction it is supposed to give. You are cheesing it, man. Yeah, so basically course, my, my, my friend and my brother, uh, he is up there. He is uh, trying to... Uh, we were supposed to place mirrors and panes, uh, uh, mirrors and glass panels here to form a cohesive image. So we've already done that. Now we just need to align these arrows and that's something only he can do because only he has the image uh, which will be projected on the wall right over there. Yeah, right over there. You see that thing there? Yep, that thing is what he needs to do form to create and only he knows what exactly what it looks like. So yes, uh, there's unfortunately nothing I can do uh, at okay, this stage uh, to help. Yeah, I was right. I have to put it correctly also, the the pins. So if I'm, if I'm not right, I think the pins are somewhat correct and somewhat wrong. Okay, you have no idea what is right and what is wrong, right? I think I'm the one now. <laughs> okay, uh, tell you what know what is wrong okay what is wrong <laughs> and this game is called we were here forever so uh, it just came out last week or two weeks ago uh, it's um 13 bucks on steam if i'm not wrong thereabouts so um if you have a friend and you want to try you know something escape room related Go ahead. It's a great game. Uh, around ten hours of playtime so far. We are in our ninth hour, I think. Okay. Yeah. Uh, first yeah. lens and fourth lens swap. Okay. Give me a moment, ah. Huh? First lens to. A fourth lens is the one that I'm on. Fourth lens is the one that you're on. Where are you? Where are you? Okay, uh, done. Okay, uh, the one that you just place in, let me take a look again. Uh, swap it with the last one. The first one and the last one, is it? Uh, correct. First and last. Double check. Thank you for the raid. Okay. Okay, uh, first and second swap. Okay, coming in. Swap complete. Roger, hold on. Ah. Uh. So tired. Okay, I just want to get this puzzle done. Uh. 
You try spinning. Uh, the arrows on top mean the light direction, right? Yeah, hold on. I'm just uh, making sure that it's all, all properly aligned. The first one is not. The second one is not. Yeah, I know. I'm just making sure that it's all properly placed. Sure, I'll leave it to you. Uh. Sure, my head's got about to blow, so... <laughs> This one is the third, I think. I think we just need to align the arrows, right? Uh, yeah, correct. That's the arrows only. Okay, so, yeah, spin, spin, spin. The rotating bar up here is very, uh, jumpy. Then um this one as well. Oh, sorry, uh th this one as well. Which one is he spinning? Ah, okay. Please may this work. And it doesn't. What's wrong with the image this time? The legs. What's wrong with the legs? Both legs on one side. Hold on, I think I found a found. Did you? Maybe not. What I'm thinking is actually um something a bit more scientific. So sometimes that as in maybe the legs need to be smaller or bigger. Uh no. Uh, it is that shadow is just uh one shape. I see. I see. Okay. Ah. Uh. I can't seem to align the align one one side of the wing though. One side of the wing? What do you mean? Uh, if facing the hour, his right wing, the tip is missing. Okay, can you spin the wing um opposite direction? No, hold on, hold on. I'm taking a look. Uh. First one is correct based on the alignment. Stream viewers, if you guys want to, you can head over to Redstone Nine Seven Six's stream, and uh, help us along. <laughs> I don't know what to do at this stage. I can't do anything at this stage. Oh my gosh! Ah. Dun 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 dun. Hold on, I think I am doing it. Go for it. Oh yeah. my god! <laughs> Good job! <sighs> my head. Uh. Uh, stupid owl reflection. Whew, okay. A 
deal release? No, I didn't. I think you released. One more time. <laughs> this is kind of dumb. Is this? Uh, we are moving. Oh, I didn't realize. So these takes us back. Okay. Ah, I see. What an elaborate puzzle! My god! Ah, ha, 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 okay. You wanna just finish this? Uh, yep. And foreshadowing, the sky is red. Yeah, let's get this done. We are approaching near the end of the story. Over here, over here. Yep, cool. It appears that uh, Jester has found the chapel. Yep. Yep, you can see the crows flying around. Uh oh. I still have no idea what we're building, actually. <laughs> I have no clue, also. Only one way to find out. I have a feeling that uh, once we put this thing, there will be a cutscene. And hopefully we'll approach the final chapter. Hopefully? It's a, it has been about 10 hours of gameplay. Yeah, and uh, the light is very weird. Okay, please, please. Okay. Did anything happen? Uh oh yeah uh, oh yeah uh, below the base there's a uh, handle for us to hold. That's in time. What was the whole point of this? No clue. I, d I don't even know what we're supposed to do this for. Uh, no idea, but uh, epic music is coming in. What? Our king deserved our respect. Such virtue the world had never seen. Our homes and hearths he would protect amidst lush fields of green. Until there came that fateful night when he exchanged the green for eternal white. Defying our fate, four families took the lead, meeting in secret. 
planning to undo our king's foul deed. Then, through magics of the long decayed, the astrolabe machine was made. Hoisted to sacred sight of high, we gathered upon the bell tower, blinding the king's gaze nearby, channeling the moon's ancient power. But salvation cannot come for all. The royal sisters, ever kind, shall compensate their father's fall. They will hide astrolabe pieces three and stay behind, cursed for all eternity. Are we the sisters? Nice like show and now this guy is just singing song. Wow. He's here just waiting for us. May I say what a splendid performance? Now it's time to escape this cursed realm. Let me take that off your hand. Final puzzle, I think. I think so. Uh, pull me up. Pull me up. Where are you? Where are you? Oh, Over yeah. here. Uh, other side, other side, other side. Wrong lever. Wait a minute. Um, this lever here. You try. This one here. I need you to be on the other side as so. well. Holding down. Uh, then, uh, 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 hold the the door. Do you let go? Okay. Okay, uh, go up the lift. Go, go up the lift. Okay. Uh, uh, give me a moment. On it. Oh my. Whoa. The heck is this? How about down here? Going up for the deep hold on. Uh, no need, I can jump down. Okay, uh, we need to push.
other side, other side. Uh. Okay. Okay, uh, now my turn, uh, send me up. Moment. Climb up the ladder. We need to shoot the the ray to the one on top. Yeah, no, uh, there's no way up anymore. I think that's the way then. Leave it to me then. Oh, okay. Uh, we need both of us to come up. Pull down your end. Yeah, in the red. Pull down again. More, more, more. Just keep doing it. Need to. Just keep with everything we did. The door? Where's the ray where's the ray shooting to now? Uh below us. This one then. The door, the door. Not yet. Is is the? Is this astrolabe? We need to raise it up somehow. Positive, I know what you're talking about. Okay. 
Okay, uh, my side here is a meteor, a crescent moon, and a two sun. Mine is stars, Saturn, and a sun. Let's try pulling one first. Nothing's happening. Maybe we need maybe we need to pull together? Doesn't seem like it. Uh, yes, but I can't interact with it. Well, first time I'm seeing where the cable goes. Uh, the thing behind you, uh, that one cannot interact, is it? Negative. Outside, outside where? Outside, outside. Uh, there is one more uh, astro ball. Uh, you see where the ray is going? There's, there's one ball there. Uh, there's the way out. The way out. I have slip. Uh, okay, you see where the last ray is uh, heading towards? All right, but. Have a good day at work. You see where the ray is not uh, going towards. It's shooting out into the sky, correct? Positive. Yeah, uh, hit towards that ray. Where it's facing, where it's going towards. Okay, cool. Ah, ah, press the wrong button. Right now I'm just uh, hanging, not doing anything. Don't walk towards the left. <laughs> There should be a way out uh, when you reach there. There's a passageway at the left of it. Finally. Ah, uh, sorry. Okay, okay, uh, okay, now, uh, now, uh, going back up again. The code's for what we need to put is, uh, we, is, uh, unlocked already. Alright. Okay, uh, go back up the other side. Uh, that's, no, it's, it's on the timer. Wait for the next one. Wait for the next one. Okay, pull a Saturn. I 
halfway down, halfway down. Okay, cool. I keep getting into the the ladder. Uh, the the ladder is that's a hitbox. So you touch the ladder, it does a go. Uh, I think next will be this one. I think the door. Yeah, yeah, hole. Oh wait, door. Ah. I don't think it's the door yet. I think it's the astrolabe, maybe. It should be the door already. Okay then, door then. Waiting for you. No, not the door. Uh, the actual date. Now the door. Okay, now, now the door. That was cool. Oh my god, why is this single die? Yep. This is
uh, ask for help. Ask for help. I see whether we can uh, whether is there a way to uh, win. Now you're dead. See you just slowly sinking into the ocean. Ay, depressing ending. Depressing ending. Question now is can we both be safe? No, as in the the double uh, ending. Happy with this game? Not bad. Not not bad. <laughs> not bad. Okay, hold on. Uh, I'm now just taking a look at uh, our stream. Last time. Okay, so three hour, three and a half, about two and a half, six plus two, and now three. Yeah, about 10 hours, 11 hours uh, of gameplay. Nice. I think it's uh, quite nice, actually. Like the puzzle really uh, go this, on and on. This, yeah. this game is very tough, actually. It's tough is one thing, yeah? It's like we're playing so late in the night. Our green power is there. Yeah, after work and all that, right? <laughs> yeah. It's actually, but I have to say this is a really good game. Yeah, and the it's a well spent on money here. Yeah. It's not even like that much money. It's like fifteen dollars only. Eighteen bucks, I think. Yeah, about. Power hours. Hmm. But uh, yeah, very very. But, re... but don't. But don't forget, uh, we got it during sale lah. So during lunch. So yeah. Yeah, that's true. Oh, but man. Hmm. I want to revisit the other, uh, the other we were here and then play on stream again. I think the others are. Uh, there's one puzzle that. Which is the puzzle that uh, you remember the most? Oh, uh, annoying. I remember the I remember the one way door one. You need to press the red button, the yellow button, the blue button. Then you need like like the wall as in got the door, the rotating door one. That one was annoying. I cannot play that one. <laughs> Not that one. Yeah. Not that one. That one is we were here together. Yeah. I can't play that <laughs> at all. Uh, that was hard. That time we played. I really just search how to know how to compete. Yeah. That 
Okay, and uh, we're done with the stream. Thank you very much for watching. If you're here, and uh, if you're here in the vault, thank you very much for sticking all the way. Um, me and Redstone will be doing more uh, streams like this soon. This game is absolutely fun. If you have someone to play it with, get it. If you're not, you know, motion sick, or you like uh, FPS games, or you like puzzle solving games, this is absolutely amazing. Um, no regrets purchasing this. Yeah, uh, Redstone and I have played all the uh, Forever games, and um, this has the most gameplay, uh, definitely. Uh, in terms of puzzles, I think that this isn't too bad. There's still one that we haven't really quite figured out, but um, we will get there. Uh, and uh, yeah, um, that's it. Thank you very much for tuning in, and uh, it's um, 12.43am here, so have a good night. I'm going to end the stream in 3, 2, 1. Good night.